chapter 17 of the Gospel according to John, American Standard Version. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information and to find out how you can volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Sam Stinson, by HisFaith.com, chapter 17. These things spake Jesus, and lifting up his eyes to heaven, he said, Father, the hour is come, glorify thy Son, that the Son may glorify thee, even as thou gavest him authority over all flesh, that to all whom thou hast given him, he should give eternal life. And this is eternal life, that they should know thee, the only true God, and him whom thou didst send, even Jesus Christ. I glorified thee on the earth, having accomplished the work which thou hast given me to do. And now, Father, glorify thou me, with thine own self, with the glory which I had with thee before the world was. I manifested thy name unto the men whom thou gavest me out of the world. Thine they were, and thou gavest them to me, and they have kept thy word. Now they know that all things whatsoever thou hast given me are from thee. For the words which thou gavest me I have given unto them, and they received them and knew of a truth that I came forth from thee, and they believed that thou didst send me. I pray for them. I pray not for the world, but for those whom thou hast given me, for they are thine, and all things that are mine are thine, and thine are mine, and I am glorified in them. And I am no more in the world, and these are in the world. And I come to thee, Holy Father, keep them in thy name which thou hast given me, that they may be one, even as we are. While I was with them, I kept them in thy name, which thou hast given me, and I guarded them, and not one of them perished, but the son of perdition, that the scripture might be fulfilled. But now I come to thee, and these things I speak in the world, that they may have my joy made full in themselves. I have given them thy word, and the world hated them, because they are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. I pray not that thou shouldst take them from the world, but that thou shouldst keep them from the evil one. They are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. Sanctify them in the truth. Thy word is truth. As thou didst send me into the world, even so sent I them into the world. And for their sakes I sanctify myself, that they themselves may also be sanctified in truth. Neither for these only do I pray, but for them also that believe on me through their word, that they may all be one, even as thou, Father, art in me, and I in thee, that they also may be in us, that the world may believe that thou didst send me. And the glory which thou hast given me, I have given unto them, that they may be one, even as we are one. In them and thou in me, I in them, and thou in me, that they may be perfected into one, that the world may know that thou didst send me, and lovest them, even as thou lovest me. Father, I desire that they also whom thou hast given me be with me where I am, that they may behold my glory which thou hast given me, for thou lovest me before the foundation of the world. O righteous Father, the world knew thee not, but I knew thee. And these knew that thou didst send me, and I made known unto them thy name, and will make it known, that the love wherewith thou lovest me may be in them, and I in them. End of chapter 17.